This is Gene Key, SkyServe News. KVUE.com reports a Houston hand doctor made famous by his TV commercials was found not guilty Tuesday of assaulting his wife in their posh memorial area home last year because Dr. Michael Brown pleaded no contest in 2002 to assaulting his third wife. The most recent charge was a felony and could have sent him to prison for up to 10 years. Now he will walk free. His estranged wife, Rochelle Brown, testified that the doctor became enraged after she accused him of infidelity. She said Dr. Brown threw several vases and a humanitarian award at her before grabbing her arm and twisting it behind her back as if he intended to break it. She filed for divorce in January of 2011. As of Tuesday, Brown did not have custody of his children, but his divorce was still pending. From Houston's KHOU.com, seven people were hurt after a two-car collision on the driving track at the Houston Police Department Training Academy Tuesday morning. It happened just after 9 a.m. in the 17,000 block of Alden Westfield. A group of law enforcement dignitaries from the city of Shenzhen, China, was there for a routine tour of the academy. They were watching and taking part in a demonstration on the track. Sources said there were two cars on the track each with the Chinese visitor and an unknown number of officers inside. At some point during the demonstration, one officer driving the car attempted to do a J-turn and ended up hitting the second vehicle, according to sources. HPD is blaming a timing issue, but wouldn't say how fast the cars were going. According to WFAA.com, administrators are facing a health scare at a North Texas high school for dozens of kids testing positive for tuberculosis. Last week, administrators tested 200 students at Ennis High School, 40 miles south of Dallas. School and health officials said an infected teacher likely exposed the students within the past three months. The Texas Department of State Health Services has called in and is covering the cost of the chest x-rays and medication for the exposed students, even while it downplays parents' fears. Doctors said just because someone is exposed to tuberculosis doesn't mean they'll ever get sick. Only people with active tuberculosis symptoms are contagious. Symptoms include weight loss, serious coughing, and night sweats. The bacteria usually attacks the lung and can be fatal if untreated. This is Gene Key, SkyServe News.